to the first part of this tutorial to make a suspender skirt for little girls. To start, I folded my fabric twice and traced my pattern using a marking chalk. So here we have the main layer. This is for the lining which is optional, two things for the waistline and two for the straps. Unlike any other circle skirt that I made, this time I'm going to split it in half. Honestly, I kind of confused if which one is the right side or the wrong side, it looks totally the same. But anyway, using the same pattern, place it in a sideways position and trace the side to make packet holes. set aside that little piece because we're going to use it in later. Right here, I'm going to make pattern for the packets. I'll make it a little bit bigger just in case. This is the same fabric I used for my lining, and we need two sets of this. Now fold the pattern in a smaller version to make these extra details in the pocket. Then sew all the side seams together. We have everything we need for the packets, time to assemble them all together. First, we need to attach the smaller piece in the packet. Now attach it back to the skirt. Make sure not to stretch your skirt, they should be all lined up. I'm marking it up to make sure that the skirt is back to normal. Then put the decorative part on top and flip the packet back, and then pin them together nice and even.
like this when it's done. And now I will pin it to the side to keep it in place. And just trim this excess fabric. Now I will attach the back piece of the skirt. Don't worry if the back is longer than the front piece, is it because of the stitching we did in the pockets. Just trim it and should be fine. I also zigzag the raw edges, make it more finished. If you feel comfortable to hem the raw edges without pressing it first, then you go for it. But I can't, I am more of a beginner style. I mentioned earlier that this is just the first part. I made a second part of this tutorial on how I made the top. So don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you won't miss out any of my new videos. Also follow me on Instagram if you like, would really love to see you there. Here I will attach my lining with the right side facing down. Then I'll sew it again on the top to keep that lining from sliding up. Alright, now I'll set it aside and work on the other pieces. This one is for the straps, so the side seams together and press it. line I'll start by pressing the side seams first. Now that it's nice and flat I'll make three stitching in the middle for my elastic. safety pin, insert the elastic one by one. Sew it and stop on the third stitching, right there. And now sew the separate sides again. Here we go, time to attach the waistline to the skirt. Make sure that you strip.
it's the public flat, otherwise it will be gathered together. The front side is a lot easier since there's no elastics. Then just attach all the accessories in the skirt. I also went ahead and attached the strap, which is no big deal. I just sew it in line with my first stitching at the back. Then I made button holes and attached two more buttons inside to hold the strap. This is all I can share with you. I'll make sure to upload the second part very soon. I'll catch up with you next time.